is sending you straight to the coordinates Captain Marvel identified in New York. Dr. Banner has confirmed that the gamma signatures in the area match those of Faustus's weapon. We need to recover whatever intel we can if we're going to find out exactly what's going on down there. Show yourself to me, Faustus, and I will open more than your eyes. Such ferocious spirit. You truly are your mother's child.
thing we need is for that pompous buffoon to win today. Stop that, Chopper. Please. With pleasure. to the Abbey for analysis. Such arrogance. Our brave soldiers will never allow you. Oh, shut up already. Take them down. out of the picture. For years, I was considered a crazed zealot in the Hydra Cabal, obsessed with the old race, embodied by the virtues of the Midnight Sun. Tell me about it. Actually, please do not.
accept your fate. I don't have magic healing. Smooth sailing so far. As ordered. Don't think I will forget that. I may need some help here. The light will heal you. like that's the last of them. Last? <laughs> there are more heads to the Hydra than you will ever comprehend, heroes. This is a minor setback at most. Well, at least we don't have to listen to you any longer today. I consider that alone a victory. Well done. If Hydra wasn't paying attention before, they are now. Stay sharp. Chill magic? You could say that. I've been staring at the night sky trying to figure it out. Figure what out? You're observant, Hunter. You tell me. You were trying to figure out how to bring Wanda back. Close, Hunter. But no. Something much more sinister has grabbed my attention. Sinister? When I was holding the trans-dimensional door for you back there, I sensed something was at the docks with you. Something dark and familiar. What did you see, Ileana? I did not see. I said, I sensed something there. But that's not the only thing I sensed today. Oh? Something has shifted in limbo. But I cannot quite put my finger on it. All I know is that whatever is happening is also strangely familiar to me. And when all you knew was darkness and despair growing up, that warm, fuzzy feeling of familiarity is not just a warning sign, but an alarm bell. We should inform the others of any potential danger. Warn them of what? One of Magic's airy-fairy gut feelings? The Avengers are already unsure of us. I do not need to add to that. Best not say anything until I am better able to articulate it. I'd like to be left to my thoughts now, Hunter. I still have a lot of thinking to do. While I try to make sense of what I felt at the docks and the energetic shifts that ripple through Limbo, I will let you know if I do.
Hunter. Hey, hey, Hunter. What do defeated Hydra agents say? Nothing. Hey, for someone they... We aimed high and we hit our marks. I need to take you street racing. Is that like running? No, in a car. You race through empty streets, pushing your ride as hard as it can take it, and leave the other racers in your dust. There's nothing like it. As soon as this is over, we shall street race. <laughs> All right. First thing, we hit a junkyard for parts. We are going to put together a real monster on the road. You do not want to use the hell ride? Nah, it's no fun if you win every time. <laughs> I could do that.
I'm glad to see you're getting comfortable with the words of power, Hunter. If you're going to continue our little investigation of the Abbey, they'll be vital to your success. Investigation? A side project, but a potentially transformative one. With my blessing, Wanda was working to uncover what may be the most powerful. Just what in the hell do you think you're doing in here? Standing in the library? I've given you free reign so you could get back on your feet. But I never thought you'd pull something like this. I... What is it you think I'm doing, exactly? Don't be coy. It does not suit you. I told you how hard it's been since we lost Agatha. Instead of letting it rest, you decide to... reopen the wound? Oh, Sarah. I would never... I never thought of this place like that. Of course you didn't. And now, it's done. Why should I ever stand in your way? That anger wasn't meant for you, dear. You know that, right? Don't hold it against Sarah. She may try to mask her feelings, but you know she is struggling with what happened. Why are you hiding from her? For most people, the captivating relationships of their lives are formed over a matter of days and years. Sarah and I spent centuries together exploring this world, fighting the darkness, watching cities and even nations form and then crumble. And yet we persevered, together. You still have not answered my question. It may be difficult to understand, but she needs this time. Sending Wanda away, sealing the library, that elaborate memorial she conjured up. She didn't waste any time trying to bury what happened. You are right. I do not understand. It isn't up to me to reveal myself. It's up to her to accept what happened and allow herself to grieve. When that happens, we'll see each other again, but not before. I trust you will do what is right for Sarah. So, what is it you are looking at here? Yes, we should get back to the real reason I asked you to meet me here. Wanda's journal. The Abbey Grounds have a great deal of history. Many of its secrets remain hidden, even after all this time. Even to you? Even to me. Wanda had taken to exploring the grounds in search of a strange energy we both sensed. Knowing that Zara had no intention of waking you to investigate, Wanda felt it was up to her to take your place. Of course, being the clever girl that she is, her notes are written in an ancient, transient cipher that I've only just begun to understand. Have a look at the first entry.
interesting. Fascinating.